All right, Sean Zatel here with the former super middleweight champion of the world, still one of the best at 168, Kayla Plant. And uh, Kayla, man, um, coming off coming off the Haney Garcia fight, and I know very close with Devin out here in Las Vegas, and kind of wanted to start there. Like, it's rough to see fighters fight at the highest level, and then the re the the, the kind of awful negative reactions people have when you step up and challenge, and, and you, you you lose. Um, yeah, man, how, 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 how tough is that to go through? And how much did you kind of empathize with Devin with what he's going through right now? And, uh, and, well, you know, yeah. it is uh, disappointing. You know, the, the fighters, they crave those fights and then they get those fights. And then they're so quick to, you know, respond how they respond. You know, for me, like, the voice in my head is what's most important. So, you know, I'm, I'm good at that. I'm good at being able to, like, just drown out the noise and... I don't really give a fuck what other people are about to say. It, what's, the voice that's most important is the one that's in here. So, you know, hopefully, and I believe, you know, Devin will be the same way. It's disappointing as it is to have the fans respond how they respond. He knows it's the voice that's said that matters most, and he's got a good team around him. So, you know, he's got to rest up, get back in the gym, and, um, you know, get back to work. You know, it's not, it's not, wins don't make you tough. You know, losses and bouncing back. You know, trials, tribulations, shit like that. That's what makes you tough. So, um, I'm excited to you know see what's next for him. Do uh, you know boxing fans? They they pay for the fights. They support the sport. Um, but do they gotta you know, or is it just a societal thing? Some of them, right? Right? Or some of a fire sticker, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. So, but um, you know, is it just like a thing in boxing, or is it like a societal thing? The way people like to kick people when they're down and and all that is yeah. Yeah. What what do they say? Uh, cowards rejoice when a hero slips. So, you know, it just shows the character of those people. You know, all the people talking crazy like that. You know, when's the last time they even ran full speed? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Got out in the yard and ran full speed. So, uh, again, I I'm not sure. I, I think because boxing is an opinionated sport, everyone thinks their opinion matters most and that their opinion is right. And most of the time, more than most of the time, it ain't. So. You had a chance to reach out and talk to Devin since the fight? Or? Nah, nah. What's, not yet, not yet. Just let him do his thing. He don't need to, you know what I'm saying? Is that is that already, did you already kind of give the best advice for, for a guy in that situation, just the voice that's most important in your head is your own, or is there like any anything uh, else? You... No, we haven't had any contact. I, I, haven't, I haven't hit him up or nothing. So, uh, you know, it's not like me and Devin are like best friends where we talk every day and shit, but, right. you know, he's someone who, I respect, he respects me, you know, I obviously have a lot of respect for most great fighters who have worked themselves up to this level because I know what it takes. So, you know, it's easy to tip your hat to somebody who, who's doing that, you know? And when you ain't doing shit and you ain't doing nothing and you see somebody else slip, it's like, oh, see, haha, I told you so, you know, you just like me. So, um, but yeah, I got, I got love and respect for them. I got love and respect for a lot of fighters, you know? So, um, yeah. What, what did you uh, think of the fight, man? What, oh, it was a hell of a fight. Great night. I thought Devin won most every round that he wasn't knocked down in. And um, I thought he boxed well. Ryan boxed really good. Congratulations to Ryan. Um, I thought uh, Ryan, he low-key really only fought in sport, spurts. Yeah. You know what I mean? Um, not really so much a complete performance, but he did what he had to do. And um, it was a close fight. So I'd love to see him run it back and give us another great fight. You know, that's what it's about. And when you keep rolling dice with great fighters, you, you might come up short in one. But uh, that's part of it. What, 